or her or anybody. Cowards do that and that ain't you. You're better than that. <laughs> Hello everybody, my name is the Bun Game and welcome back to the Death Battle Reaction. Sorry it's been a while since I've been a video, but... And also, I have graduated. That was, well, that, was probably a, that was probably last week, to be honest with you. That was probably last week, Sunday. On graduation day. So I did graduate. Though, oh my god, it was so hot outside. I wanted to take that thing off. So, I have now graduated, and my birthday is almost here, but my graduation probably will be on July 14th, no, July 4th, but, yeah, so, but I will get a job eventually. <laughs> so, I'm not going to college, I'm just going to work, so, yeah, that's what I'm going to do, just work. Anyways, but. Welcome back to a new video. So, as you may know, this is Doctor Strange versus Doctor Fate, which I don't know really much about Doctor Fate, but now I know much of him now. Though his, all of his abilities are fucking everything you can do is crazy as fuck. <laughs> so, I know Doctor Strange. I knew him first before they talked about. Dr. Fate right now, so I might, I might have voted for Dr. Strange on this one, but my vote might be wrong <sighs> but anyways, let's see and let's find out oh sh I almost pressed I almost pressed the wrong button <laughs> to stop the recording so yeah Stephen Strange. It has come to my attention that there are two Sorcerer Supremes in this existence. I am here to resolve this embarrassment. I see somebody needs a lesson in manners. <laughs> Then <laughs> Star Wars, then the Star Wars universe. <laughs> it's Chuck Lewis versus that guy. Oh. Oh yeah, Dr. Fate can go other universes if he wants. So yeah. Oh well then where are they now? Aha! I understand your have... power now. Oh yeah, without his helmet, he's useless. So the god is just a man in disguise. Let's see how you fare with him. Ha! Shut up! Ashta, grab me the crimson bag for Cinerac! A friend once told me the helmet doesn't make the man. Yeah, it, can, it can come back to him. I will use it. Oh, he's used his final weapon. Witness your true fate! Final attack. Oh, his 
super versus uh, super thing. Uh, Maybe in there. Ah, that's right. By the hoary hosts of Hoggest. Where am I? Doctor Strange. Welcome to my home. That's his soul, so... Take an oath to never take a life or whatever? Analyzing this matchup was bizarre. You might even say it was... strange? Save the puns, Wiz. That's my job. But yeah, <laughs> both these doctor wizards were so stupidly powerful, trying to find their limit was like looking for a needle in a haystack. But nobody remembered so to put the so needle there in the first place. With their maximum potential seemingly unmeasurable, it's easy to make an argument for either one to win. If given the chance, Strange could have certainly, say, stolen Fate's powers, or maybe even just willed him out of existence. I bet plenty of yeah. Strange fans are letting us know how in the comments below. And that's fine, but Death Battle looks at the larger picture to find the most likely outcome of them all, and Fate simply held the advantage on a grander scale. Strange may have fought a 5,000 year war, but Nabu's been around since the beginning of the universe, over 10 billion years. He definitely had way more experience. Fate also had the advantage of casting the majority of his spells non-verbally, while many of Strange's required specific hand movements and incantations. Still, it was only a matter of time until the Eye of Agamotto informed Strange of Fate's one weakness. Depowering him wasn't as easy as you'd think. He had his own magic, and his superhuman strength was something Strange didn't have at all. Basically, anything Strange could do, Fate could do too but even more. Remember how Strange cast a spell which moved him six quadrillion times the speed of light? Yep. Now remember how Fate's helmet flew from Earth to the edge of the universe and back? It took about one year to make this trip. Given the estimated scope of the observable and unknown universe, a trip of this magnitude would require the helm to fly nearly 28 decillion times the speed of light. That's over four quintillion times faster than Strange. Look at it this way, Strange was a man borrowing the powers of a god, while Fate's a god borrowing a man. Plus, that power boost with Inza's of soul from the amulet put Fate on a level above the gods in his universe, something Strange can't really do himself. Nope. Both Doctor Strange and Doctor Fate possessed incomprehensibly impressive magic, but Fate held more experience, greater physical abilities, and a wider range of talents. Which left Steven stuck with a strange twist of fate. The winner is Dr. Fate. Good job, Dr. Fate. Thanks for watching, guys. If Good you want job. exclusive commentary on this episode, click that box right over there. And if you want the battle music for yourself, there's a download link in the description. See you next time. What's the next up, battle? I'm invisible. I'm unstoppable. I'm alive. I'm tamed. I'm a cannibal. Uh, Raihu vs. Jen from Taken. Oh, I've played Taken before. I played the game before. Before I played Street Fighter. No, that was a different one. That was a different number of the Taken series. But yeah, so. So, Dr. Fate won. My vote was wrong. So, if you guys voted for Dr. Fate, good, f good for you. <laughs> So, so, Dr. Fate won that battle. And the next battle is between a Street Fighter character versus a te Tekken or Tekken. I don't know how to pronounce it, but yeah. That's pretty interesting. But So, yeah, it's the next battle. But, anyways, like if you like this video and the death battle. Comment, subscribe. Thanks for watching. Right, guys? I'll see you all in the next video. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye, guys.